It is a good step that the external affairs ministers uh, who are briefing all party leaders. We welcome that, uh, that move on the part of the external affairs minister. So we are completely with the government as far as national security and the safety of our citizens are concerned. What's happening in Bangladesh is very worrying. Uh, it's not just, you can't just say that it's merely a adopting of an unpopular government. It seems to be uh, something more deeper than that. The safety of our citizens, the safety of our borders is very, very important. And eventually, whatever government forms there, we have to make sure that that government is, um, uh, is in line with us in terms of our uh, national interest and it's not uh, against us and it's not from the some radical government to against us. So primarily a question has also been raised uh, because the, prime, the former Prime Minister of Bangladesh has, has is now in India and now she is seeking asylum, political asylum, political asylum from the other country. Will then she will choose this thing in, in our country only. So how do you see this? So, uh, I think the government is to be capable of uh, handling that. This has happened before in the past. Uh, in the past, uh, also when Mungu Rahman was assassinated, uh, they were given refuge in India. And I'm sure India will, will deal with this in a very humanitarian way. But the overall important thing is our national security and our safety of our safety.